Good morning everyone. If I look tired, it's because I am tired and I have just woken up from my sleep um, from Saturday night, which, you know, obviously I'm going to look tired. So today is Sunday, we're going to be going to Mablethorpe and I'll be recording all throughout the day. I don't know if it's going to be as long as yesterday, but today is our last day recording, sadly. So I hope you have enjoyed this series. But today is going to be the last video, so let's just see what today brings, and let's just see if you enjoy it. Time to get dressed, though. But while I wait, I'm just going to say about my sleep. I slept in the awning last night, so on Friday to Saturday night, I slept in the van, which I rated about a 6 out of 10 because it wasn't as comfy as the awning, and I absolutely loved it. So if you are wondering where you want to sleep and you can sleep in the awning or the van, I'd recommend the awning. Uh, it depends, though, how you set it out, but it was really comfy. I'd rate this about a 9 out of 10. I mean, clearly. Oh my god. Okay, so I'm just got in the block thingy. Oh my god. I don't know if you can hear that van whirring around in the shower. Oh my gosh. I told you that I wouldn't film around in here because of privacy. But I mean, it's only me in here, so I just don't know if it's going to flash. So for any of you who don't like flashes, I'll just put a warning on the screen. Is it going to flash? I don't think it's going to flash, you know. Okay. Oh my gosh. Hi. Um we got a nice sink there. I'm literally doing a bathroom review because, you know, you know how I love doing bathroom reviews. This is such a weird channel you're watching right now. Okay, so I'm just going to be brushing my teeth and then we're going to be getting ready for the day to go to Mablethorpe, which I'm so excited for because apparently they have a waltzer. Yesterday, the waltzer wasn't that good because there was only one person running it. Uh, we all know it's better when there's people spinning the cards. It's going to flash now, but I recommend getting these. Yeah, sorry, someone just tried to open the door. I recommend getting these because they are very camping friendly and, you know, they hold your toothbrush and it's very helpful because they have these holes that prevent them from water getting in, which helps prevent mold. So, you know, we all want no mold. Okay, bye. I'm sitting out here in the sun doing some editing and I thought that this was a perfect time just to tell you about something that we got, which is absolutely genius. So my dogs are absolutely a pain with escaping. Well, not this one, uh, but this one, yeah. So we bought these things. You may have seen them before. It's a long wire that basically coils into the ground. You see that over there? I'll circle it. It literally, like, it coils into the ground. You can screw it in, and it's very easy to use. It helps them stay with you, which, you know, we really needed that with him. <laughs> Mablethorpe. Let's see what we're going to do today. We made it to the beach and we walked past the Mirage and that street park and it's so busy that it's almost impossible to record down there. But look at all of this, it's so crazy. We're thinking of eating at the Beck, which is a restaurant in Mablethorpe, but we just don't know yet because we don't know what food they, what the food they sell. And I have to be gluten free because, you know, celiac, I have celiac and yeah it's just interesting is it just me or is the water over there yellow theming is on point here is the big beach but i don't know if dogs are allowed there. oh yeah there's a dog over there oh yeah and i forgot people called joe aren't allowed on this beach so just kidding i absolutely love the beach it's way more different from yesterday but it's a lot more lively and i prefer this one from yesterday's beach look out here i love the view Again, you can't convince me that the water's not yellow. I mean, Skegness water is brown, so it makes a difference. <laughs> Alfie's just literally gotten a starfish, as you saw from that clip. I, I own some weird dogs, I do. I made a deal with myself I wasn't going to be recording anymore on the beach because, you know, it's not too interesting except for me. So we are at the restaurant right now, The Beck in Mablethorpe, and we are going to probably get some food. I thought it was going to be a bad idea to go on the rides after eating, but it seemed to work yesterday. Okay, 
once again we are on the beach once again it is windy and once again i'm here for another update about life in skegness it's not really life in skegness it's a trip to skegness so we got ice creams we also got on a few rides we went on one that's basically like i don't know how to explain it so you'll just have to see for yourself here it is So yeah, that was really fun and we are walking the dogs at the moment and we are going to be making our way to the van again. Ugh, oh my gosh, I'm just, this is hurting my hands just to hold the microphone and my phone at the same time. But today has been so fun. We did go to the Beck in Mabel for, for a little lunch and ugh, just fell down the hole and they did do some great gluten free food. Uh, which I thought was amazing and they do guide you through so if you have celiac disease like me and you want to go somewhere then I strongly suggest the Beck at Mablethorpe as they will help you a lot and they have a lot of understanding of what to do for celiac so yeah see what we do next but apologize for the glitchiness but we are back from Mablethorpe uh, I don't know what I last recorded it was probably on the beach but we are back home now and uh, the next thing we are going to be recording is back at the van please don't step in my lemonade oh yeah I got a lemonade because I was very thirsty because it's very thirsty work walking around Mablethorpe <laughs> 